As we grow older, we become wiser, more mature and more enlightened about past decisions, both good and bad. Take the case of model Chrissy Teigen, who said that apologizing for bullying has made her become a stronger person. I personally stand a queen who owns up to past mistakes and tries her best to be a better version of herself. Before we continue, continue watching till the end of this video so you won't miss any information. If this is the first time you visited our channel, please click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you get updated when a new video about your favorite celebrities comes out. In an interview last Tuesday, the model said she's 100% sober and feels clear-headed. The said interview was her first since she was accused of cyberbullying over the summer. The model Courtney Stodden, who uses their them pronouns, revealed harsh tweets and direct messages they received from Tygen when they were still teenagers in a May story published by the Daily Beast, prompting the 35-year-old to apologize for her past actions. She also added that she has taken a step back since then in order to grow and learn from the experience. I look at my kid and what I want their values to be and how I want them to treat people and to see that in myself that I wasn't doing that was, I think, the hardest part for me," she said. Clearly, she hasn't thought about the impact it would cost for the other person and that she didn't think that anyone was going to read her messages. The model stated that she has subsequently reached out to those she has wronged in the past, calling it a significant moment for her. There's this cliché about I'm glad that happened but it generally made me a stronger, a better person," she said. Today marks my 100th day of sobriety. I now have a really clear mind. Stodden, who married acting instructor Doc Hutchison, 51, when she was 16, said Tygen sent them messages encouraging them to have a dirt nap in a May interview with the Daily Beast. She wouldn't just openly tweet that she wanted me to take a dirt nap, but she'd privately DM me and tell me to kill myself. Sodden explained. Things like, I can't wait for you to die, she says. Tygen stated in her June apology that she had publicly apologized to one individual who appears to be Sodden, but whom she did not name, and that she was in the process of privately contacting others she had insulted. The truth is, I'm not the person who wrote those heinous words anymore. I grew up, received therapy, married, had children, received more therapy, experienced loss and suffering, received more therapy and had a fuller life," she wrote at the time, and got more therapy. According to People, Sodden previously stated that they had forgiven Tygen and accepted a past apology, but that they haven't been privately contacted by the model. Tygen, now a mother of two, said that she feels like she has done the work since the bullying allegations surfaced. All I want is that these individuals forgive me and accept the fact that they've hopefully seen me improve. She said. Cravings Altogether, her latest cookbook, was released last Tuesday. Again, being able to own up to past mistakes and apologize for them takes a million ounces of courage. And as you enter parenthood, the last thing you'd want to happen is for your children to know the negative things that you were involved in or that you did in the past. We do hope that the parties involved have closed that chapter altogether and start anew. That's it for today, folks. Thank you for watching. Please like the video and share it with amazing fans just like you. Again, make sure that you hit the notification bell so you won't miss any new teas about your favorite celebrities. See you on the next one.